All right, we are going to make a candle out of Crisco. A candle out of Crisco. That is what we are going to make. That's what this is. It is a candle made out of Crisco and nothing else. The wick will be made out of 100% cotton string. 100% cotton string. Now I've got a washer tied to the end of it. You can use a nut, a bolt, or whatever, something heavy. And that is just so it will hold in place roughly in the middle of your container. Now a lot of people will just get a, a candle and stick right down in here and uh, light it. But I, I like the glass anyway. And I like the wide tops, the wide mouths. That way that flame gets a lot of oxygen. Anyway, so this six pound tub, this six pound tub of Crisco will burn a flame for 575 hours, 575 hours roughly. So about eight hours a day for about 70 or so days. That's what this will do this six pound tub anyway let's get started here this is this is excellent for a, a grid down situation economic collapse something like that you have this stuff stored just for making candles store tons of it just for making candles then have your jars have you lots of jars stored away that way you can make them as you need them Anyway, this is for the poor folks like me. All right, let's melt just a little more. Let's get a little more. This is a one-handed deal here. I'll melt just a little more. I've got some melted. cooking beans well I'm not my wife is she told me to keep an eye on them anyway we'll let that melt a little bit that wasn't the Crisco spoon there's the Crisco spoon I don't I don't I don't need any kind of cooked oil whatsoever All right, so you're just going to put your Crisco in a pot and warm it up and break it back down, melt it again. It, melt it, turn it back into an oil, a liquid. One hundred percent cotton string. Put you something heavy on the end of it. A washer is what I used. That way I can get this fairly in the middle. And then, and then I'll show you how to, once I pour the oil in there, the Crisco in there, I'll show you how to keep it, the top of it, in the middle. But this is it. This is a pint. I don't know how long this pint will, will burn. Um... I don't, long, I don't know how long this particular candle here will last, uh, but it'll last a long time for sure. The uh, six pound tub, like I said before, will burn for 70 or so, it's about 72 days at eight hours a day. 72 days at eight hours a day. That is roughly around... 575 hours. I will cut this off. Let's put this over here. Let's get us a little cup. Dip it out. Like I said, this is for the poor folks like me. You don't want to go out and spend just tons of money on candles. 
And in a bad situation, I would rather just have the stuff to make my candles and not have them already made. It ain't nothing to make. I mean, it is absolutely nothing to make a Crisco candle. Absolutely nothing. Now, this is hot. Very hot. Now, what I'll do to keep this in the middle is I will... Uh, let me put this lid on this Crisco. I will take this... You can do it with anything. I'll take this. See if I can do it with one hand. And I will twist it. I don't think I can do it with one hand. Okay. Let's see here. Let me set you here just for a minute. Just for a minute. Bear with me. I know you didn't get to see that, but uh, I just twisted it and twirled it on there. Get it roughly in the middle, about there or so. Anyway, that's it. That is it. That's how you make a candle out of Crisco. A candle out of Crisco. That'll dry and be just like that. Now this is a cool little candle. You can you can put your lid on it to snuff it out and leave the lid on it. But that is a cool little candle. Let's turn some lights off. It is daylight outside, so it ain't gonna get too bright, but look at that. This will burn for hours upon hours now. Like I said, this six pound tub will burn for roughly about 575 hours. That's roughly about 72 days, eight hours a day, somewhere in there. Six pound tub of Crisco, $10, will buy you a 575 hour candle. You can't beat that. Hey, if you're a prepper, if you're a prepper, store you some of this stuff. Man, get you, spend you a hundred bucks and have you ten. Ten of these containers. That is a, that is a lot of candle. A lot of candle. I went out and bought, I've just started this. And I've just started buying this kind of stuff here for candle making. I've been taking my wife's old candles and, and storing them away for hard times. But uh, now I'm going to start with the Crisco. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to buy several of these containers, store them away somewhere in a safe place. I've got three of these bought already. I will be buying more and vacuum sealing them to keep the dampness out. And I will be burying these in a... Uh, 55 gallon steel drum I will be burying them that way it'll keep them at a good temperature and I am going to end up with several of these I will have an absolute lifetime of candle when I am done anyway keep on prepping prep 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 never stop prepping Crisco candle Crisco candles we'll see you